Hi and welcome back to our channel and today we're going to discuss five ways on how to keep your huskies cool during summer. We have already excluded in the title um, in the list the air conditioning and the fans. Uh, let's just say you want to take care or you want to own a husky without having those two it's still uh, doable. As long as you follow these five ways. First way is shade. You need to have shade. So find a place around the house that's shaded. Uh, it's important that your Siber Siberian Husky is not exposed to direct sunlight. So it could be in this room, in your room. Uh, also if you have a cage with a roof that's also good or anywhere in the house like the porch or if you have a balcony as long as it's in shade not directly from sunlight second is hydration hydration is very important especially during daytime not much so during night time because yeah, they don't get really uh, feel warm or thirsty at night because you know, it's sleepy time. During the day, uh, especially if you are going for work, you need to provide them with enough water to last for the whole day. This one is a bit small. If you can have a bigger tray, bigger than that. Uh, much better it may last uh, until the evening so that's very important second third is exercise so Siberian Huskies are uh, working dogs so they are very energetic you need to um, have regular exercise with them not it's not always uh, it's not just good for them it's also good for you it's uh, abundant so while we are on ECQ uh, what you can do right now is uh, walk around the house uh, play with your husky have a quality time uh, play ball I have a ball here um, if you have other dogs uh, play with them so that energy can be um, let out uh, it's an exercise uh, just like us if we are uh, if we have regular exercise we regulate our heat our body heat and if we are fit uh, we are less uh, susceptible to uh, feeling hot or worse getting heat stroke so exercise is really important. Regular exercise. Fourth, diet. We don't want our huskies to get uh, fat by overfeeding because if you overfeed them, uh, tendency is they get big, they get chubby, and you know if the body is big, uh, gets hot, gets warmer, and you know the danger there is that there might be a possibility of a heat stroke and we all don't want that to happen. So aside from exercise, we also need to put them on a diet just for summer. In our house, um, what I do during summers is that I take 20% off from their uh, regular feeding uh, ratio. So. Every day, I only feed them 80% of what is uh, what I normally give them. So they may get a little thin, but at least they don't suffer heat as much as those uh, other huskies that are uh, overfed or um, overweight. So that's the fourth one. Lastly, the fifth way is... Uh, related to water uh, you need to wet their feet or their paws if they're here 
uh, inside the house uh, you can grab a towel an extra towel and uh, wet it with water and let your huskies uh, walk uh, around it so it regulates uh, their body temperature it cools their body temperature in such a way that um, the heat that they are feeling will become less so they won't they'll feel better they won't feel uh, hot like if you have a cage also you can always use your hose you can sprinkle uh, water around the cage and also on their feet so that's very helpful already for our pets to fight the very warm climate that we are having here especially in my place in our country it's very hot during summer so just those five ways they are able to uh, help your Siberian Husky uh, keep himself or herself cool during summer so that's about it let's just uh, review the five ways of keeping them cold during summer so first again it's shade second hydration third exercise fourth diet and then fifth the last one you uh, should wet their feet whenever you can this five ways and your husky is more or less pretty much happy with uh, passing through summer so that's about it so if you have thoughts uh, if you have anything to add up opinions or reactions just write in the comments below we'd be happy to hear from you and if you're new to our channel don't uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and uh, i'll see you on our next video thank you and god bless